segue into the theme of this month's video. This first story happened when I was working at Subway. That's right, another Subway story! Hashtag Subway 4, it wasn't good enough to be in the other three. So, it was five minutes until closing, and we get a phone call on the Subway phone. I pick it up and say, <sighs> Thank you for calling Subway, how may I help you? I was supposed to say, this is James, how may I help you? But, I wasn't about to tell this random stranger my name. <laughs> Idiot. Anyway, the other person on the line said, Hey, what time do you guys close? In five minutes. Is it alright if I show up late? I just need gas. And being the good employee that I was, I was totally willing to make this guy's sandwich over the phone, let him pick it up after we closed, and then I wouldn't ring him up and just pocket the money. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that. That's a crime. Please don't sue me. So I said, Yeah, I can do that. What kind of sandwich do you want? And he said, I just need gas. Oh, don't worry, sir. This sandwich will give you plenty of gas. Uh, I, I mean, do you want chips or something? No, he said. I just need gas. I was a little confused. Okay, yes. So you'll get gas. Then are you going to stop by and pick up a sandwich? And he said, I don't want a sandwich. And then it hit me. Even though the first thing I ever said to this guy was, thank you for calling Suabway, I think he thought he was talking to a gas station. So I said, Sir, this is a Subway? Oh. And I never got the chance to tell him that gas pumps don't close.